friends, welcome back to PIB Popcorn in Bed. It is a matinee for me today. I'm very excited to watch. Am I excited? <laughs> Anxiously excited to watch Gangs of New York. I had a live stream and during the live stream, I took all the DVDs that I had been sent in recent months and I picked out four and put those on a poll. The clear winner was Gangs of New York. So that's what I'm watching today. Someone said, this is not a Carly movie. So Carly is not joining me today. I don't know what that says about me, but um, you know, I'll, I'm here doing the hard work and she can show up for Bond. Just kidding. Just kidding, guys. She's really pushed herself recently. She watched The Departed. Speaking of The Departed, this is the same director, Scorsese. If you haven't watched our Departed reaction, I thought the story was very good. I thought the acting was even better, but I really had a hard time with that ending. So I'm a little nervous about this one. I know that Martin Scorsese isn't afraid to kill people that you get attached to or that are your friends or that you want to have some redemption. I know Leo is in this as well. Cameron Diaz is in this, which is weird. I don't know that I've watched a movie with her on the channel, but I love the holiday. What to expect when you're expecting? <laughs> I weirdly watch that often. Guys, there's gotta be bigger movies that Cameron Diaz is in. What happens in Vegas? Okay. <laughs> I'm expecting violence, a lot of violence. I'm expecting crudeness. <laughs> but I'm expecting a good story and good acting. I know this is critically acclaimed. I don't know that, I made that up. I assume it's critically acclaimed. Okay, real quick, Patreon, like, subscribe, bell, you're the best. Okay, let's do it. On purpose? No, it's not. The blood stays on the blade. Aww. Some of it I half remember. The rest I took from dreams. Hey, Liam Neeson. Who's that? Saint Michael. And what did he do? He cast Satan out of paradise. Goodbye. Oh, he's a priest in a cave. What time period are we in? Are we bringing a child to battle? Sounds like a kid on a recorder. What's the bottle? Hey, the dead rabbits. What are you? What do you think? I do not understand, guys, what I am watching. Feels like that rave in the Matrix, too. Are you with us or not? For the last time, Val, on the witch, if the money is right, I'll give you a ten. Per notch. Ten per notch. Per new notch. Then I'm your man. Oh, maybe they're like reenactment people. Um, what? Seem to be outnumbered a bit. You swore this was a battle between warriors, not a bunch of Miss Nancys. So warriors is what I brought. The O'Connell Guard, the Plug Ugly! I can't tell if this is real or they're pretending. I think it's real. The Chichesters! The 40 Thieves! Bene. And my challenge to settle for good and all! Who holds sway over the five points? Us natives or the foreign hordes? And let it be known, the hand that tries to strike us from this land shall be swiftly cut down. Are we killing people right now? Oh my gosh! <gasps> oh my gosh! No, it's real. That's real blood. Oh, dislike this. <gasps> Why are we letting children watch this?
will be the trophies of the day. But no hand shall touch him. He'll cross over whole. Not before I got what's owed. No! It's fair. A touch and delicate. Fair. Um... What do we do with the boy? Give him to the law. See so he gets a good education. It's done and outlawed. Let no one even speak their name from this time on. In 46. You have grown from a boy into a man. The Lord has forgiven you. It's the boy. You also must forgive. Hellgate House of Reform. For 16 years. In the second year of the Great Civil War, New York was a city full of tribes. It wasn't a city, it was more a furnace where a city someday might be formed. Oh, oh wow. Oh, we don't like Lincoln here. Oh boy. When the Irish came, they got a right warm welcome. Like far, far away. I only came two hours down river, but they all took me for an immigrant. Oh. Welcome to America, son. Your long, arduous journey is over. America for America! New York loved William Tweed. Thank you for coming. It's an honor. Mr. Tweed. Okay, I figured out who this guy is. Daniel Day-Lewis. Last of the Mohicans. Phantom Thread. I have not seen it yet, but he's Lincoln, right? I chewed each and every one of them before they set foot on American okay. soil. Okay. Father's Night? You see, Michael, the Archangel. I ain't talking about an alliance between our two great organizations. They're talking about muscle work. The appearance of the law must be upheld. Especially while it's being broken. Give me the strength for what I must do. Who are you? I just like it down here is all. Say what's in his pockets, Jimmy. Look, boys, I really don't want to fight. Don't worry, son. Ain't gonna be much of a fight. <laughs> Where'd you get that? I told you I didn't want to fight! Why not? Look how good you're done. <laughs> you're the priest's son, aren't you? <gasps> you? Get away from me. That's who I tried to help you. When the natives took you. Who is that? Thought she was killed. <laughs> <gasps> Five points. Paradise Square. Always lively in the evening. Yes. Where are the gangs now? I love when they explain things. The frog hollers Shanghai sailors down around the bloody angle. Sure tails become a bunch of Jack Roland dandies. There's a plug ugly. No one understands what they're saying. They love to fight the cops. The night walkers are rat pickers <laughs> roll. The slaughterhouses and the Broadway twisters. They're a fine bunch of bingo boys. Bingo! And the little 40 thieves. They got took over by Bendrick the cockroach. Bendrick carries a journey. If you try to leave the gang, they say he hacks up blood on you. This is chaos. Any young got the sand of the dead rabbits. You don't say that name. They've been outlawed. I was in the black house. The chinks told me that the natives celebrate their victory every year. Aye, that they do. That's quite Affair. He's the guy that took his money. Look where you're going, Johnny. Quite a pair of conversationists, aren't you? <laughs> Maybe not. Or deep thinkers. <laughs> I leave you in the grace and favor of the Lord. She actually can pull off red very well. She is a prim looking stargazer. A prim looking stargazer. I do believe she lifted your timepiece. I let her take it. I let her take things all the time. I recognize him. We always liked a good fire in the ports. There were 37 amateur fire brigades, and they all fought each other. That's the politician guy? Oh boy. Well, there's nothing left. In your next time of trouble, call on Tammany first. But it's not too late. You can still save my house. I'm so confused. This area is the province of my own America's Fire Brigade. May I point out your right man? Am I? Oh, that's who killed his father. What's the point? The fire's near burned. Anything of value inside. Next building over. Take off your walls. What's the point with this one? This is my house. 
I... Everything comes here. We fence it. Johnny takes our tribute to the natives and we chop up the winnings. You might as well settle with me before settling with each other. He's still around too. Ah. Now this is just a thing for Mrs. Mulraney. Leave us with something to quarter to build a boat here, eh? Not my favorite tune. You keep out of trouble now. I don't understand. I'll just keep watching though, don't you worry. Every year the natives celebrated the killing of my father at Sparrow's Chinese Pagoda. When you kill a king, you kill him where the whole court can watch him die. He wants to kill the guy who killed his father. Am I right in that? Right here, we'll left you. Give us a drink, eh? Help yourself. Was that real here? Do the commands. Bowser against the vermin. Ew. From me, me lad, sir. Made he was. Where's he from? Oh, he's not from here, sir. You won't recognize him. In memory of priest. Your friend can't look me in the eye. That's not an admirable characteristic. No one can look you in the eye, Bill. Not when you're playing cards. Please don't make that noise again, Harvey. What is wrong with this person? There's a Portuguese ship lying low in the harbor. Consider it done, sir. Good boy. And you, what is your name? Amsterdam, sir. I'm New York. Don't you never come in here empty handed again. Daybreak boys catch us on this river, they'll slit our throats. I told myself, I don't keep quiet. Daybreak boys have already been in. What is it? Jimmy, get down! Who did that? There's nothing here but a bunch of dead sea crabs. Come on, let's go. No. Is this fresh? Four hours most. Much obliged, gents. Why do they want a body? What? Ghoul gang slaughters. It's a notice you can be proud of. Thank you. Low Is it? thing to do that to a body. Maybe they don't share your religious scruples. Maybe they're just a couple of fit on bends. Ooh. I don't know what that means. If you had said chiseler. Now there's a word I understand. Now is that what you're calling us? Supposing I am. Well then we got business. Right? Just like that? And then we just do this? It's kosher. Come on, my boy. It's just a kid. <laughs> I can't tell who's punching who. But I know I don't like it. Why are they doing this? Oh, he's a literal butcher? <laughs> I think I'm gonna... Trim the ears and the beak off of that head. Make a nice pot of soup. We could find a tastier head than that, Bill. I ain't got the stomach for no Irish. Is that something that's common here? That we cut off people's ears? The Lord squatted over the side of England, and what came out of him was Ireland. All I ever knew of Ireland was in the talk of the others at the orphan asylum. I was raised in a very similar establishment myself. Now everything you see belongs to me, to one degree or another. The beggars and those boys, the sheehees and the chinks. Everybody owes, everybody pays. But that's how you stand up against the rising of the tide. Three square meals a day. You could buy your way out for $300. Out of the jail? But who had $300? They was too scared of the gangs to come after us. Good morning, sir. Don't you run into me. Oh, oh. I said don't run into me. <laughs> Everything in place? Seems so. Well, then I leave you in the grace, grace and favor of the Lord. That dirty man! She's good. Hello, me. That depends on what you say. How is she so good? Prettiest girl in New York. Only New York. <laughs> <laughs> May I walk with you a little? That, sir, would be too bold. She is good. For every lay, we had a different name. An autumn diver picked your pocket in church. <gasps> a badger gets a fella into bed with a girl, then robs his pockets. Jenny was a bludgeon. 
a girl pickpocket, and a turtle dove. What does that mean? A turtle dove dressed like a housemate and goes right through the back <gasps> door, robs you blind. Takes a lot of sand to be a turtle dove. I'll have my medal back. Oh, Jesus! Oh, his dad's medal? Let me you my business or I will open your throat, so help me God. Go on then. Go on then. Go on then as in slit my throat? Are you gonna make out? Give me back my medal. I don't know which one's yours. <gasps> Suppose I help myself to everything. Suppose you do. I feel like there's some intention here. Just had each other at knife point. You wanna, wanna stroll? Wanna chat? Maybe we could pal in together. Oh, I think you're a bit uh, rough for this sort of game. Well, what do you call to the butcher? The butcher and me have a special arrangement. I don't want to see you again. Well, I don't blame you. <laughs> the Scammerhorns is one of the oldest families in New York. I'm sure we can be in no danger. Why wouldn't the constable's company, my dear? Quite so, madam. Witness. Well, you dare to leave it there? Safe as a bank, since I'll know it's mine. Is that man drunk? Dead as good Friday. Huh? Good day to you, Mulraney. May I present? The Scammerhorns of Fifth Avenue. I'm William Cutting. How do you do, Mr. Cutting? As of this moment, extremely well, thank you. How do you do? I'm very scared of him, I think. Well, welcome to these streets, and we'll pass in safety. Oh, I'll see you to safety. Good day, lad. He knows who I am. Oh, indeed, sir. I don't understand the politics of this, I don't think. You think my watch would be safe up in that lamppost, Bill? Why don't you hang it up there and see? Someday. Someday is right. Hey, you see your face, son. You get to know a lot, Butcher, and me. I love to work with pigs. The nearest thing in nature to the flesh of a man is the flesh of a pig. Is Amsterdam getting Stockholmed? I feel like he came here for revenge and to kill him, but he's starting to like, like him. This is a wound. This is a kill. This is a kill. An in artery. This is a kill. You try. Bill's taken quite a liking to you. Now, if you're up to something, Benny. Only I don't want no part in it. I'm just trying to make my way is all. I can't get a day's work done for all the good citizens coming in here to harass me about crying in the points. Something has to be done. What do you have in mind? Maybe we should hang <gasps> someone. You stand here convicted. I see you dressed for the occasion, Arthur. You know, me, Bill, always like to look me best, you know. It's a nice locket. I'll give you a dollar for it. It's me mother's. Dollar and a half. Don't. Is he about to go die? I'll miss you, Arthur. Is my son present here? Farewell, dear boy. May God greet me as a friend. Stop it. Why is there no value of life here? That was the five points, all right. Hangings of a morning, dancings of an evening. It's not a matter of words. I can tell by the way she smiles. Well, she smiles well, with a lot of people. Come with that. <laughs> Into the mirror. This is mean. It's like hot or not. That one. Now what? Regular services are held at the church at six and eight. Oh, no. <laughs> not much of a dancer. Just try to keep calm. You can hold me tighter if you like. So why didn't you dance with Johnny? I didn't want him. Oh shoot. I'm both excited about the prospect and sad for Johnny at the same time. You know what I was thinking? What's the butcher's special arrangement with her? How can I know? I'm not wanting this. Wait. How does this open? It takes too long to lace back up. We'll be here all night. Are they in the streets? All right, I'll take it out. A stable, perhaps? There is a baby. They cut it out. Have you got any scars? From the hell house? What's that then? It's a gift from Mr. Cutting. Don't tell me you're angry with me. I'm through with you. 
You're quicker than most fellas. Well, I ain't interested in the butcher's leavings. Everyone was working for the butcher, even me, my father's son. Did anybody pay off the goddamn police? The municipal police! This is the metropolitan! This is the Ask for your opinion! The law says that there's no cops in the inner city. Well, where does the city end? People die! What? The man whose vision made possible this noble combat, Mr. William Kennedy! Oh no, he's got a top hat on. He is stuck homed. May I remind you of the further wonders of my museum? P.T. Barnum's Gallery of This is the greatest show! That would have added some happiness. It's happiness. It's a feeling being took under the wing of the dragon. It's warmer than you think. I knew it. He's starting to like it. Americans are born. I don't see no Americans. Name one thing they've contributed. Votes. And there'll be a handsome price for each vote goes Tammany's way. My father gave his life making this country what it is. You think I'm gonna help you befoul his legacy? Why? Because they come off a boat crawling with lice and begging you for soup. You're a great one for the fighting, but you can't fight forever. I can go down doing it. And you will. Uh-oh. What did you say? I said you're turning your back on the future. Not our future. I don't like him in that hat. That document makes you a citizen. This one makes you a private in the Union Army. Now go fight for your country. Next! Make sure you keep it dry on the boat. Oh. They feed us now, do you think? They just go off that boat. Look at that, it's showing off that boat in that boat. Back into the coffin. What happens at the finish then? Haven't you never been to the theater before? Lay down your whip cradle, Uncle Tom's head! Lay that dead! Well, that's horrible. <laughs> Who's that guy? The blood of the Irish bill get down! Somebody put the butcher! Oh! 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 Was he gonna take a bullet for him? Well, that didn't tell us very much. <laughs> Fine waste scope. Will I keep it as a souvenir? Is that him acknowledging you saved my life? Is but is he, one. like, bleeding? He's very confused. Now that was bloody Shakespearean. I don't know what in the hell you're talking about. He has your thick Irish whelp, just like your father. He knows who he is. Yeah. If you're not strong, you better be smart. Your father was a man who loved his people. Oh, he's deeply conflicted. Look at that. What in Christ's name is that? I feel so... Jig doing a jig. Yucky. Bill! I had the nose and came over as quick as I could. Or as timely as the angel of death. I want this to be done, this part. Bill. This looks fun. It's gonna be tight. It's to make me cry. You can take it. What are they doing with that thing? To the butcher. To the butcher. To the butcher. Why don't you get out of here, Johnny? They don't have rooms in this place? Is there anyone in the five points who haven't f you? <gasps> what? What? I think he's really drunk and I think he needs to be careful. Try it and I'll bite you. I don't think you warned me, huh? <laughs> they have an interesting relationship. <laughs> Dear heavens. Ah! Hey, Dad. What's he doing there? I can't sleep. Is your uh, shoulder that's keeping you up? Oh, I don't ever sleep too much. I have to sleep on one eye open. I only got one eye, right? Oh, I forgot he only has one eye. There's like a bird in the other one. How old are you, Amsterdam? Not too sure. 
Never did figure. I'm 47. You know how I stayed alive this long? Fear. A spectacle of fearsome acts. Somebody steals from me, I cut off his hands. He rises against me, I cut off his head, stick it on a pike. Raise it high up, so all in the streets can see. That's what preserves the order of things. Why do I feel like he's gonna, like, cut off his fingers or something right now? That one tonight, who was he? I killed the last honorable man 15 years ago. Since then, he gave me this, you know. That was the finest beating I ever took. And when he came to finish me, I couldn't look him in the eye. He spared me because he wanted me to live in shame. This was a great man. When I cut out the eye that looked away, sent it to him wrapped in blue Oh paper. my gosh. And I rose back up again with a full heart and buried him in his own blood. Well done. He was the only man I ever killed worth remembering. Uh, yikes. I never had a son. Civilization is crumbling. Yep. Big part to you. God bless you. This is weird. Weird. Lines are blurred. Who is he to you, Jenny? I was 12 years old. My mother was dead. I was living in a doorway. He took me in. But he never laid a hand on me until I asked him to. Lines are blurred. Who are you? He doesn't know. <laughs> this movie just makes everyone sad, right? This is the celebration. Feast your eyes on these exotic creatures! How do you like to make them sing? May God put the steel of the Holy Spirit in my spine and the love of the Blessed Virgin in my heart. Amen. I mean, do they really have to pay for the bird sings? It seems like it's pretty available. He's not who he says he is. take it out for you. His name is Balin. His name is Balin. No, Johnny. Guys, if this is like The Departed, I don't know that I'll be okay. Short sleeves, because everyone can see he's got nothing stashed. That's all that never becomes a fashion. <laughs> Johnny. Uh oh. You know what's weird? All of a sudden, I feel so inappropriate wearing Crash Bandicoot. <laughs> oh, it feels weird. Oh, cause the, the, this. Guys, what's gonna happen? William Cutting wearing a waistcoat of certain distinction. <laughs> I'm very scared of him. He also... His hair looks very greasy. He needs to dry shampoo. Okay, I'm, I'm distracting myself. The Butcher's Original Apprentice! What do you say, Jen? One more time for the sweet souvenir. I'm very nervous. <laughs> you may feel more comfortable without that garment. You'll have to filch me a new one, though. Holy cow. Oh, my heart is beating very fast. What about that locket that I gave you? Your apologies, my dear. Pick it up. Whoopsie daisy! Oh! I can't seem to get anything right tonight. You got the sand to give them a grand finale? I feel like he just ruined whoopsie daisy for me. This is a night for America! He knows. He knows. Hearts off! Hold in our hearts the memory of our fallen brothers. To defeat my enemy, I extinguish his life and consume him as I consume these flames. Is this physically possible? In honor of Priest Valen. That's a wound. Oh, Freak no! Martin Scorsese! I took him under my wing. Oh, Jesus! Splay him out! This is fresh meat. We need to tenderize this meat a little bit. I'm not watching this! What the heck is this? What will it be then? A liver and kidneys! What just happened? The kidneys! 
This boy has no heart! Kill you killed his father! He ain't earned the death of my hands! He'll walk amongst you marked with shame! God's only man, spared by the butcher! Help! I've saved 10 cents out of every dollar I've ever earned. This is what I wanted to show you. This is where we're gonna go as soon as you get well. San Francisco, California. You can have anything you want out there. We need to get there. Go down, no. around here. Don't go that way. Shortest way to go. I'm so sad. I've got 44 notches in my club. To remind me what I owe God when I die. My father was killed in battle too. That war is a thousand years old and more. Your father tried to carve out a corner in this country. If he'd lived a bit longer, would he have wanted a bit more? Why'd you rifle through his pockets then? For safekeeping. I wasn't getting the money. Blood stays on the blade. Now what? We do have to get out of New York. But maybe just like Philly, California, in this economy? Rabbit. That's a sorry looking pelt. He's a psycho. Tell me, this charge, does it sit uneasy with you? My allegiance is to the law. I don't give a company f about your moral conundrum, you meat headed sh sack. Punish the person <laughs> who's responsible for murdering <laughs> this poor little rabbit. <laughs> is that understood? Uh. Right. You fought for the dead rabbits. You fought next to his father. Didn't mean nothing by that shot, you know. You scared me as off. Liar, liar, pencil fire. Remember your father and me. Are you too young to remember your old Uncle Jack? You know I won't hurt you. Is he gonna kill him? I think it shows dash. Give the boy some time, we'll settle with a good dust-up. Him. Matilda's dad. From the new Matilda. Oi! Boy! There's more of us coming off these ships every day, and we're afraid of the natives. Get all of us together, and we ain't got a gang. We got an army. That was me play too fast. I'd take it back if I could. Take it back? Johnny, I gotta kill you. You gotta be better than him. Get out of the points and don't come back. Still hiding out with your friends? I'm not with them. With the natives. <laughs> a native is a man who is willing to give his life for his country. Are you willing to do that, my young friend? Johnny. Johnny. <laughs> Just kill me. Please. I'm sorry, Johnny. What are you doing here, Boyle? What's that doing the next door? Oh. Ah, did you know there's a in your church? We're doing this again? Jesus. The earth turns, and one night you look up, one spark, and the sky is on fire. It's a touching spectacle. We'll come back when you're ready for us. Our name is called the Dead Rabbits to remind all of our suffering and is a call to those who suffer still to join our ranks. For with great numbers must come great strength and the salvation of our people. The Archbishop himself, shoulder to shoulder with half the Irish in the five points. I'm offering my boy to form an alliance with you against Bill Cutting and his slate of nativist candidates. Sheriff, you back an Irishman for Sheriff and we'll get him elected. <laughs> To have me looking as sober as my own grandfather. Could I say what I want? That's why I wanted you. Our elected representatives are a gang of thieves, dipping their hands deep into our pockets. Yes, I like this. First war to win is not down in Dixie, but right here in these streets. Yes. Line them up. It's election day. They're forcing them who to vote for? Shave their beards off and send them back to vote again. <laughs> Monks already won by three thousand more votes than there are voters. Democracy! <laughs> He's gonna rage. It's from Bill. 
That's a club he's got. Citizens of the Five Points, should I engage and silence this relic of the ancient law, or be your chosen voice in the new world? That one. There you are, Bill. Let's see if we can resolve our grievances the democratic way. So a handshake. <gasps> I want you to see this. This is you, right here. Match 45. Stop it! Oh. My. Gosh. You killed an elected official? You tell young Valen, I'm gonna paint Paradise Square with his blood. Two coats, you come down to the points again, and you'll be dispatched by mine own hand. I'll get back to your celebration and let me eat in peace. I hope you get salmonella from that raw, gross meat. Oh. My. Gosh. Challenge. Challenge accepted. Right now? Not right now. And then it came. They read out the draftees' names like they was dead already. James Mooney! They break tomorrow. Break spats. Axes, knives. Pistols. No, pistols. Good boy. This is real life. They're gonna do this. of anger over Mr. Lincoln's draft. Can always hire one half of the poor to kill the other half. Yikes. I come to say goodbye. Johnny, give me one more day and I'll go with you. He'll be dead by then. This will all be finished tomorrow. No, it won't. No. This whole place is gonna burn anyway. I've heard that the poor are going from door to door, asking those who wish to see further riots. Place a lighted candle in the window. I prophesy a very dark night. Let the sons of the rich go and die, they cried. Let the sons of the poor stay home. The earth was shaking now. So this is a whole separate thing. Almighty Lord, he were the dagger in my hand, for he is good. Let my sword devour till its thirst is quenched with blood. Be allowed to pray for that. The Lord God of retribution crushes the wicked. Is merciful. Amen. 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 <laughs> Attacking colored boarding houses. The mob have just broken open gun store and are arming. Oh my gosh! There is danger of mob attacking armor. Jenny! It's that music again. First, ride at Pier 4, North River. <gasps> are we joking? Barnum's American Museum on fire. Animals are escaping. Jenny! Gunboat Liberty, ready to open fire on the mob. The rats have taken over the city. <gasps> There's a mob headed for the colored orphans asylum. Oh my gosh! Don't take a prisoner no. in until you put the mob down. This is sick. The mob will not disperse. This is sick. What are your orders? Oh my gosh. I order you to disperse! Fire! I can't. They're all gonna die. Everyone's gonna die. This side, that side, everyone. What are they shooting at? No. I'm so scared. I'm so scared. Ah, for you! This is what I would do. I hate him! Oh, okay. What is wrong with you? Fight him like a man!
Get our people down to the docks. We want every man and woman coming off the boats given hot soup and bread. We're burying a lot of boats down here tonight. They put candles on the bodies so as their friends could know them in the dark. The city did this free of charge. My father told me we was all born of blood and tribulation, and so then too was our great city. But for those of us what lived and died in them furious days, it was like everything we knew was mightily swept away. And no matter what they did to build the city up again for the rest of time, it would be like no one even knew he was ever here. <laughs> World Trade Center. Well, that was a lot. In the middle there, I literally had to pause and go and hug my kids. Daniel D. Lewis is a crazy person. Like, was. Uh, like, that was insane. He was horrifying. In, like, I love Leo. Cameron Diaz was so good in it. After watching this, I remember learning about the the draft riots. It's crazy that this whole movie like culminated to this gang fight being showcased next to the riots. It almost was like, what's the point? Do you know what I mean? And it's like often that way, watching back in hindsight, we're killing each other. So I don't know how much of that is true and false and whatnot, but had like an epicness to it, I guess. Like the the battles and the drumming and and that made it feel crazy intense. But then there was also like these middle parts of like, is he in too deep? Like does he actually secretly love him? And oh wow the blood and the I did really like the love story though. We're okay in the end. Thanks, Martin Scorsese. <laughs> wow, but wow. I guess like it's so interesting to learn more about that time and immigrants coming in and what they were facing and the poverty and the oh disparity and contention. I think it was pretty amazing performances by Daniel Day Lewis. Did he win something for that? And and Leo. It did it's one of those ones that like gave you that icky feeling though, you know? I guess it's with a lot of Scorsese films that you're like, wow, I I'm blessed. <laughs> Anyways, wow, wow, wow. I feel like that one is gonna stay with me for a bit. Okay, thanks so much for watching along with me. Have a wonderful night.